G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Jean Woodle and welcome back to 7 Days, welcome back to the Australian Overhaul mod. I'm always so excited whenever I come back into this, it's my favourite game in my favourite country, how could I not be singing the praises from the tallest of rafters when I'm coming back with lots to do. Baker's already saying nah mate, shaking his weirdly shaped hat at me but we're all good the last horde night was a disaster i've got a couple of days to figure it out which means gotta crack on i've come back out to investigate and just remind myself of how <laughs> how bad that horde was gee whiz how how i got away with that i'll, I'll never know i'll never know i copped a couple of demo explosions to the face there's also that new spider jockey thing not the nice happy one out of minecraft with a skeleton riding a spider oh no this one is so much worse i have to i have to fix that i have to fix that very quickly but today is also a good day for another reason another reason i'm excited because look there's the morning job look at this Look at this gyrocopter on a motorcycle and 10 more seconds before a brand new cement mixer as well. How can you not feel light and fluffy when you can get up to the skies? Oh, it's so exciting. I've currently got this cement mixer making me a whole bunch of sand. I did spend some time last night while these things were crafting, down mining so much stone. I've got 15,000 stone on me now. That's going to take 45 minutes to craft. It will be less. If I whack on, I'm currently wearing them. I'm currently wearing the XP gogs, that's fine. And then it will not be less. 45 minutes, 1300 concrete. With concrete production actually moving relatively swiftly, that's going to do me an awful lot of favors. Uh, I'll grab the motorcycle. I'll leave the gyro at home for the moment because I don't really have a spot for it. Plus, when I do find a mission that's oh, a decent way away, I can probably grab it. But. Well, we, we could get the treasure maps. We could get the treasure maps and the dirt pose. We could go and explore Tasmania. In fact, you know what? How could I? How could I make it and not immediately take it with me? It's a big day. It's a great day. Spin her up and let's see how it goes. It's going to quickly run into Huey's and see what he's got on offer. Oh, how are you, the hot stuff? You restock tomorrow. I've already gone through most of your things. Oh, I've got no money anyway. I've got no money from buying my gyro and stuff, so... Can't really do anything about it anyway. Can I see your jobs? So you've got a tier two fetch to the north. You've got not a lot going on. There's this. That's the closest one. The Narva's getting creamery. Okay? Mm, sounds creamy. Be. Just what you need first thing in the morning. <sighs> do I go do that? Maybe I'll do that on the way back. I'll do that on the way back. I want to go explore, but it's foggy now. How can I go flying about in my gyro if I can't see the tip in my bloody front wheel? I'll have to do it later. I'll have to do it later. The inkball weather has ruined our fun. I don't want to go crush my bird into a mountain. Pull up out the front. There's a couple of newspaper stands around. Might even leave my gyro in you. Well, hopefully it's nice and safe from Muppets like me accidentally binning this. Couple of untouchies. Something to sell. And... Oh, damn it, I need that last urban combat book. I really bloody do. All those have already been read. Check the last one as well for, again, nothing? Well, that's not fucking nothing, is it? I do have my um my tier five tacky boy. Can I just quickly sneak on in and grab, grab you? A Spears book, no good for anyone. Nothing and <sighs> nothing too. <laughs> where's all, where's all the everythings? Why can't I find anything of value around here? There's fucking donuts outside. I just need one more book. Oh, that's a problem. Oh! Holy! All right there, champion, you bloody rights. Oh, he's having a heart attack. Hold on. Nah, punch you one more time in the face. The cure for all heart attacks. Breaking noses. You're fine. I got you. Why is everyone coming to say good day to me? Is this like a part of a horde or something? I was having a nice little time. I did mildly murder a bear, but that's no reason to get that upset. <laughs> I don't know where they're coming from. Turns out the city has a lot. Thank you. Has a lot of zombies in it. But I don't even really need the, the vehicle books anymore, do I? Like, what do I need them for? To make another gyro? I'm already fine. Give you a little tickle. Reset you. Reset the newspaper stands as well. You bloody beauty. Got any sniper books? Got any urban combat books? No, just a great heist book and Magnum Enforcer. 
Okay, not too bad. What do you give me? High power 44. No, thank you, but thank you. Oh, I do remember this place. I remember the creamery. I thought it was the cannery. But uh, all right, it's, it's called the creamery, I guess. This one has like the sick apartment building all the way at the very tippy top. I lived here a million years ago in... I don't even know. I don't, I don't even know what the series was. It was one of the series that I did, but there's so many now. Um... Was it just like, was it Insane Nightmare? I think it was. I don't know. Either way, I have some fond memories of it, which should mean that I can get through here reasonably well. But things have definitely changed since the last time. Holy shit, since the last time I came through. Oh, oh, no, I closed myself in. I closed myself in. Idiot, absolute plum pudding. How did you fuck that up? You couldn't even grab a bloody door handle properly. What was I just saying? Oh, this should be nice and easy. Yeah, fucking good job, Josh. Clearly not. It's still you after all. I've got a flaming, a flaming zombie coming over. Can I fix you up? Yeah, I can. Nice. Gone. I don't know why you're on fire, but that's a good... Thank you very much. That's a good little, uh, good little tester, a good little sign that there's probably, probably an invisible jet of fire around here somewhere. Activate you. Someone's up. Oh my God. I charged out there immediately. He's not dead. I didn't really mean to do that, but he's dead now. I heard a doggo. Bonds away. Got two skill points to spend. I'll get right on that. In fact, it would probably be a pretty great idea to put that towards uh, armor or something. Get your gooey and smack that ass like it's too fast, too furious. Up. Oh. Where did the dog go? Where did the dog go? We just cremated someone. <laughs> Old mate's been shoved into a ditch. I definitely heard. Do I, have a, do I have a mission for you? I definitely heard a dog. I can still hear a dog. I don't have a I don't have a dog to murder flop, so you're safe for now. Oh jeez, I don't like knowing he's out there somewhere barking and gnawing and slowly making his way towards me. So that's gonna be the jet of fire. I can't get through you. Do I have to go around the back way? Makes the most amount of sense. Is there any, any more fake ceilings or something that's gonna spawn a thousand rad zombies at me? I mean, that's, that's the nozzle on the pipe, so that should... Oh, jeez, I hate this. Yeah, no, nah, it didn't get set on fire. <laughs> Beautiful. That's, that's where we're at. Oh, fuck. That's where we're at at this point. If I don't immediately burn to death, it's a good day. Oh, I woke everybody up. I was trying to be stealthy, boys, but I've got my helmet light on. Oh, got my helmet light on, so it's, How the fuck did you hit me? So it's probably never going to work for me anyway. Oh, that was a lot of balls to finally get you down. I'm going quickly reload for the rest of them to show up. This was like a job for Knuckles. Punch. I get you sat, please. Oh, okay, that, that glitch is starting to really piss me off. I've got you staggered. You stand there squirreling about holding your noggin. At no point did you swing your bloody sticks at me. I don't know. Is that a... Hmm. Has that always been a thing? I feel like it didn't used to happen quite that much. That and like the stagger forward. I hope that gets fixed enough for 20... Nope. And in 1.0, definitely not Alpha 22. It's a completely different update. Because that, that, that's such horseshit. I hate that so much. I'm making pretty good time, which is good because the weather still hasn't cleared. Is it only like super clear in the morning? Should I have left before the sun rose so I had that morning dawn to try and sort this out? Because I feel like it just hasn't gotten any better this whole bloody time. Run across to you. There is the satchel that I needed. Thank you very much. Grab you. Job done. I'll finish it off though because I'm a fiend for loot. And what's my loot station here actually? I'm level 64. 168. That reminds me I do have two skill points to spend. And I reckon it's got to be heavy armor. I think it's got to be heavy armor. Given what I'm up against and just how dangerous that horde knight was, I feel like it's got to be heavy armor. I think I actually... Oh, damn it. I think I actually sold... Ah! I think I actually sold some uh, some steel armor not that long ago. Maybe like a steel helmet or something, which is bloody silly of me. But now we know, we can rectify. Okay, let's try and do this a little bit better. I've got my headlight off this time. Let's try and actually do some stealthing. And thank God I tried to as well. Please die in one. Shit, didn't die in one. Did you wake everyone else up though? Or was it just you? Finish off with a swift punch to the chops and wake everyone else up. Love that for me. Can I get an angle? One there. Nice, Gary. Another one over there. I'm just trying to get a better shot of him. Like that. Even nicer, Gary. Bowling Shane. Is there anyone else? 
I'll take my ball back out of you. I'll take my ball back out of you. All right. See, there you go. That's how you do it. That's how you do it when you have talent. A rare occurrence for me. We're coming up to the loot area up the tippy top. I can hear a lot of things beating on stuff down below, but that's all good. Make sure both my guns are loaded. Only 30 rounds in each magazine. They probably... They probably need some decent magazine upgrades on that one. You're a feral. Didn't quite get you properly. I got one good, but not the next. I still don't have any, uh, any damage buffs yet. There's one. There's two. Not quite three. In fact, a lot of it I got one so far. Missed the follow-up. There's the two. There's the three. Nice. Okay. As long as I keep on moving around, that's why I didn't really want to go into um into heavy armor to start with because heavy armor slows you down so much. Spear hunter, sick as dicks. Thanks for nothing. I'll try to get you straight away though. But if I can find, fact, I already have that book. I think it might be the last one I need from the urban combat one. Urban combat. It's the last book I need from the series. Oh, the armor doesn't slow you down when in combat. If you get that then suddenly armor is totally more viable. But until then, it's a little dicey. Oh, there's a whole, uh, there's a whole wandering horde just here. If it's not, get the old horn out. The horn says no other purpose, but you know what? I'm a big fan of free XP. Old man tried to sneak up behind me, not bloody happening. Oh, he almost did though. A little bit of lag spike when you got nice and close to me. Who's with the weakest? I it doesn't really matter. Whoever gets closest gets punched in the face first. Should have my full 15% per percent damage buff. I can hear doggo whimpers. Is there... Oh, is there a dog in there that needs to be saved? Oh, this takes on a whole, a whole new mission now. Drop you. Drop you as well. Nance, you need to be gone. Dog? Oh, it's a wolf. It's a wolf. That's okay. It's not a paddable dog. Don't worry about it. Leave him to his own devices. Don't go touch wild animals. It's never a good idea. It's looking much clearer out here, actually. It could be time to get up into the skies. Quickly hand in my quest to you. Uh, be, be quick about your business. Skill magazine bundle. Oh, but it's not like it's not a book magazine. It's not a book bundle. It's a magazine bundle. So it's not actually the one that I need. Iron chest armor, ammo, forged steel. I guess I'll just take the skill magazine bundle. None of those are getting me excited at all. Cheers, knackers. Um, none of those are getting me excited at all. I'm just going to know. I'm just going to know. I'm going to take the very brave decision to say, get absolutely stuffed, mate. I am going to use my gyro. Take all of that. Can I pick you up as well? Do I have any space? I do not. And actually, I should quickly duck on back home because I do need to make sure my concrete is on the craft that my sand should be done. My inventory is full. Yes, yes, I know. I know. It's all right. Calm down. We'll get there. Nothing to worry about. So I've got all the stone in the world and all the sand in the world, but I'm actually running super duper low on cement. In fact, I'm going to cancel you and then cancel you. 805. So 400 into that one, please. And 400 into that one, please. Divvy it up all bloody nicely. Do I need another forge? I could probably actually just use you. Oh, is that silly? Is that silly? Oh, uh, I mean, I could probably double up. I wouldn't have the room for another forge. I could have really wanted to, but in fact, my base looked chockers as shit. Plus, oh, hang on. Hang on. Stop. Stop. Stop you. Stop you. I forgot. I forgot. I forgot that... Shit. I forgot that stacks of concrete were a thing. That's not a thing in vanilla. Also, why are you still spinning? Um... Yeah, okay, I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna put only, like, 20... Was it like 20 more cement before I can make myself a um uh a, a stack of concrete. So let's get like 800 stone. Put you back into them. I'm gonna chuck you straight into here, like you and you and you. Put in some fuel. I hope that works. It should work. I mean, of course it'll work. I just I just need the stone for cement. I'm just nervous about doubling up in a forge. Just another couple of more, please. Beautiful, perfect. Thank you. Stack of concrete. Bang. Much, much better. Much, much smarter. You can go into there. I still need... I can't... I can't make boxes yet. I can't make the bloody boxes yet. How far away am I from... Uh, it's going to be Pistol Paint, I think it was. Fuck you. So I'm one book away from making bulk 9mm. I'm one book away from making bulk 7.62. Whichever one comes first, that's going to be whatever I make into AP stuff. 
I can't believe I'm one away on both. That's such, <laughs> that's such horse shit. I hate it. Got my fuel sashed away and my motorcycle. You should be all fueled up and ready to go. All right, let's head south. We are down in Melbourne. There's a nice little mountain range down there. Let's get up and see what the world has in storm. I just want to go and scope out what Tassie is. I mean, I, I know there's a Tassie on the map when I first looked at the map in like episode one. There was definitely Tasmania down there. So it's not one of the fabled maps without Tasmania. So there it is all the way out yonder. So there's, I mean, obviously there's no bridge to Tassie, although there's something. Or is that just like a glitch in the, a glitch in the chunk? All right, because there's a diagonal one going there as well. Oh, look at this though. This is where I live. This is my home. That would be like Port Phillip Bay, like just down there. That's Wilson's Prom over there. And then the, uh, the coast out that way. 12 Apostles out that way. I mean, look, <laughs> clearly Melbourne's built a bit more inland than it would normally be, but oh, it just makes me feel nice. Just makes me feel all nice and snuggly. Yeah, that's definitely not a seam. I thought it was a seam in the chunk that Aaron loading, but it's actually just like the tiniest spit of land you've ever bloody seen. Long and very narrow. All right, so it is actually connected, which is kind of fun. Is that a trader? It is a trader. So Tazzy's got three buildings and one of them is a shop. <laughs> All right, works for me. You got to keep your, your sausage roll and big M supply up and going. Is there any like interesting POIs here at all? I might just quickly chuck down the gyro, uh, grab the motorcycle again so I can... Uh, perfect, so I can go and explore the town a little. Not now, not now. <laughs> This is cool. Look at the mountains on either side. Dude, I like this. I like Tassie. Bunch of free workstations to loot as well. Thank you. My armor is weak. How did my armor get weak? Oh, there's, there's, a, there's a lot going on outside, actually. Hang on a second. Open the door and let him in. Oh, that's a rad. Uh, uh, I need to get a little bit of... I do have the anti-rad in my knuckles, but it's probably just wiser to get a little tickle on you from range. You see, she actually swung around. Does that mean you still managed to miss? Go on. Go on, too. Yeah, doubly sure. Always double tap. I learned that from Zombieland. Baker! Want need another Baker? No, I already hired a new Baker. I don't want too many of them. He doesn't want to be hired by me anyway. Getting hired by me? Death sentence. So who have we got? Oh, it's a Trader Joel. Wait, Trader Joel was my first trainee. So you're going to have... Holy... Nah, you don't. I thought for a second you were gonna have tier four quest, but no, that that was with um that was with Bobby Boy, wasn't it? That Trader Joel was my first uh, trader, but that was all the way back up north in Townsville or Cairns, not the one that I mained at. Fair enough, fair enough. I can't I can't raid you. Cash register. There's zombies beating on shit outside. I'm gonna quickly check your vendo for nothing. I've got a little bit of money on me now at the very least. All right, but good to know. Dude, if you had tier four quests, I'd have spent a lot more time down here. Come down, get a big boy quest, go back out to Melbourne to complete it, and just come down to Tassie on the weekends. Perfect. I'm hearing some noises outside that I really don't love. It's either the new, like the new sounds of Yetis, or, or it's a demo. Nah, it's just, a, oh, it's a, all right. Yeti V versus a thrilled neck lizard, and the lizard's gonna win. Oh, bud. Oh, bud. You should have watched Jurassic Park. Things are big thrills like that. Absolutely not your idea of a good time. Ah, no. I saved you. I saved you. Why are you mad? Why are you mad at me? I did you a favor. We come from the same continent. We're supposed to be friends. I've done all my raiding, I think. So now, Trader Joel, we've got your inventory. Oh. I'm $20 short. Do I actually need that, though? I definitely do. Do I have space for it? Tripler. Doubler. Tripler. Doubler, tripler. So I definitely need you. Would you like to buy? Be seeing you. That was a fucking big gunshot out there from somewhere. Uh, what can I take off you? Armored up books. Oh, jeez. There's actually quite a lot of things that I want from you. Mm. That's going to be the baker, I think, just next door. Do you have any cement, actually? Cement? No, you don't. All right, I'm going to need... What you're looking for. I'm going to need some we money. Get. Very bloody quick. We're all so far away. Can Tier 2 fetch, 100 meters to the south. Right Absolutely. Here. It's Let's 10 get. to 3. Nitro Express. Nitro Express raid. Get in, get out, get the gubs gun back again. I want to buy those trippy pox. Oh, that's what's happening. I gotcha. I gotcha. Oh, did you... Oh, he's not dead. He's not dead. He's not dead. He's dead now. All right, you're fine. You're fine. The old double pay, uh, double baker power. 
Just as a big, it sounds like a fitty cow. It really does, and it makes me clench that little bit. You need to get sold or jump on the bike, though, and get out there. I've got to go fast. I've done my good deed of the day. I've saved the bakers. A book to sell. Thank you. Now, I just need to be rewarded. I've already checked the letterbox. The bakers, the bakers are coming to help. I'll quickly restart it so the bakers... Oh, can I actually... Oh, can I yeti? The bakers can actually help. They've lured out a couple of them. Can I actually... Hang on a second. Can I actually help here at all? Let's go... Them... That didn't count as stealth shots? Why not? They're not angry at me. They're angry at the bloody pastry boy over there. Give us a spell. Oh, I missed the shot. So I'm wasting my crossbow. Can I piss off you too? Right through the small of your back. No, no. Stop that. Don't. Don't you bloody dare explode that car because I need to kill you myself, I'm pretty sure. Oh, it's just a fetch. I lied. It's just a fetch. We're fine. Get you good. Get you dead. Oh, God. Here comes a couple more, though. Oh, there comes a lot more. All right, bring him to it. I already tickled you, so you shouldn't regen. <laughs> he, he clipped the bloody barbed wire and stopped dead in his tracks. And then you jumped in midair for some reason. Ah, oh, I need to die. Thank you. My arm is weak again. Oh, jeez. Ah, magpie. Magpie, no. Oh, there's so many magpies. What is going on down here? Tasmania is like a wildlife preserve. Fuck off. Fuck off. Get out of here. I didn't want it to be this way. I'm trying to get back to save the baker. I did the hard yakka for him a second ago, but I've left them to their own devices somewhat. I think they got killed. Ah, I think they got killed. Hang on. Take all of you. Over the barbed wire we go. Completely shank the first shot. Get him on the second though. That's a Harley. Oh no. Oh no. If, if Harley's here and the bakers are not, does that mean that the bakers are gone? I'm going to be sad. I'm going to be sad. I tried so hard to keep them alive. I didn't even drop their bag of gubs. Damn it. That's doubly wasteful. I've got to keep going because I've got to get back to traders before he closes and buy that tripsy. In fact, I'm going to... Ooh, 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 ooh. Can I try? Super duper stealth. Yep. There you go. Two and a half to... Oh, I was thinking... Uh-oh, Pidgey. I was thinking of knives. Knives has the ridiculous stealth damage. Knuckles do not. That's a bit unfortunate. That's very bloody unfortunate even. Cheeky ammo pile. Nothing really much in you. I thought I was being so good. I thought I was being so good with that. Turns out... I'm just misremembering. Again. We've got to drop on down. We all know how I feel about drop downs. I do not like them at all. I'll take that bolt back. Thank you. I'll close that door and open this one instead. <laughs> Most of this game at the moment is trying to anticipate where I think the game wants me to go and then going the other direction. Try and sneak up on the game and go my own way. Grab you for the springs. Springs are worth money. Got a little bit of time. So really, like, the only thing is that I really wanted out of that trader were just... Uh, well, yeah, that was the, the trippy pockets, but also, like, some gunpowder and stuff. But there wasn't really anything especially enticing. Oh, it's it's this place. Didn't this used to be a kitchen? Uh-oh. 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 Um, fuck it. Fuck it. Oh, oh, yeah, I closed the door and he said, fuck you, I'm coming through anyway. Oh, uh-oh. Oh, that's bad. I was going to say he's going to burn the bloody house and I'm stuck in the middle of it. Now I can't see fucking anything. Oh my god. I was about to say, did I even bloody kill him? I clearly didn't. Do I have any fluids on me? No. Um, fuck. I've got to get the supplies. I've got to get the supplies though. Can I, sta can I get down low and go, go, go? Or is that just for smoke inhalation? I might need to wait for these. Okay, those those are at least iron, so they shouldn't get destroyed. I've got to, got to try and get through. I've got to try and get through. Get you out of the way. And you out of the way. Can I, like... Can I put you out? Was it the shovel that puts it out? No, maybe it was with an extra mod. Damn it. Damn it. Do I just, do I just go for it? But if I get set on fire, what do I do? Duh! Oh, that, looks like, that looks like a gap. Looks like a gap. Oh, it was a gap. Very gently sneak on through them. Can't go through that way. Uh, okay, so the loot room is still okay and untouched. But I need... Shit, it's only in here somewhere, isn't it? There it is. Get you out of the way. 
Grab that courier satchel through the flames. I hope you're wearing gloves. Grab you. All right, at least the job's done. Let's get the loot and get out of here. Fucking cops, dude. Why do you have to do that? I closed the door and I immediately was like, that was the wrong decision. I needed to tickle him to stop him burning the place down. And instead, he burned the bloody place down. The fire's slowly spreading, so grab your loot now, please. Chuck him a side box and a shamway. Grab you for steel knuckles. I can scrap you for parts and sell those. Some gunpowder, thank you. An awesome sauce. If only there was some bloody sugar butts in the um in the vendor at tradies. There is not, however. I'll read you. Quickly grab the arrow pile as well for not a lot. Grab that. I think that's most of everything done. I mean, look, there's probably some more out there that's just going to have to get lost because I... Oh, fuck. Because I cannot get to it even if I wanted to. Where's the dog? Dog's not there. Shit, jump. There's the doggo. Nice. Okay. All right. We're all right. I can get out of here, go back to Trader, and pretend like none of that happened. Oh, wait. Hey, whoa. Hey, whoa. What? Fucking tier five Legos? Ah, uh, okay. I always, always get to... It's a bag on the ground. It's like nothing even fucking important. Didn't even give it the time of day. It was a tier 5 steel leg armor. Oh my goodness. My thighs are quivering with excitement. Getting those strapped onto them. Fuck a duck. That's a good get. All right. Happy days. Pro some Pat's been by with his black and white cat to give me a knifey book. All right. Fucking lovely. That's gone very well. That was worth almost getting burned to the ground. That's such a ridiculous jump up from tier 5 padded up to tier 5 steel. I've skipped like seven layers of um of armor there and I'm absolutely stoked about it. Put you in. You can get sold. You guys can go back away if you have the room for it. That can get sold as well. It's worth like 100 bucks. That can get sold as well. I don't have a repair kit. Could I make one? I reckon I can make one. Give me you. Uh, do I have... I do have you. Let's go duct tape. Make one of those to make a repair kit. Which person do I actually need to get the, the forged iron out of the bike, please? There you go. Make one of you. Uh, you guys can go back again. Purely because... You're... Oh, my God. Uh, right. Okay. I was going to say purely because you're worth so much more money if I get you repaired, but... I've been rudely interrupted by a horde, a caravan full of gubbins, which is fine, actually. If you guys have any anything in your pockets you'd like to donate to the cause, now is the time. Thank you for coming to my TED Talk. It's going to rock your world. So satisfying. That's so satisfying. A couple of bits of dropped loot with a book and some arrows and some steroids to sell. I can make a T5 claw hammer, you beauty. Read that. Take all of you. That was all of the loot bags. Right, what was I doing? That's right, repairing you. Uh, you guys can go back away there. Don't want to sell you straight away. My scrap you for, uh, for the iron. They have no real need to use you. You can go in. All right, I've got a little bit of money to make here. I don't think it's worth popping an awesome sauce, even though I got it for free. That's mildly, extremely, actually, wasteful. Uh, nothing here to sell, is there? Uh, I mean, you're 63 bucks. I'll sell you anyway. Scrap you. And I'll take you to sell two, actually, because you're worth 100 bucks. Beautiful. All right. Well, let's go finally see Trady. Jump back on the bike and get to the dorm. That was, um, that was weirdly profitable. That was actually pretty good. He's not offering me heaps, but he is going to offer me some T3 iron gloves. Now that I've gone into heavy armor, I might give it a whirl. I uh, finished off your tier two. 54 John, $5,000 reduce, food bank. I'll take the money. Any special jobs? Trader Hugh in the north. I'm pretty sure that's the bloke in Melbourne. Yeah, it was. This is free XP. All right. Can you, real fast, just double check, just double check. In case you overlooked it, you definitely didn't overlook it. Trust yourself. It was worth the two seconds to make doubly sure. I want to sell. I actually don't want to sell you. You could be worth a lot of money if I save you till later. I'll sell you and you and you and you and you and you and... I don't think I wanted to sell that last it's one. Did I, did I want to sell that last you one? I don't think I did. There. I think the tier sixes are probably better for that one, but all right. Well, that was an overswap. We're fine. I was too busy distracted by the lack of sugar butts. I'll take you. Speedy running shoes mod. You're a fucking mod now? Yes, please. Give me you. Whack them in me booties. What else you got for me? What else you got for me? That's very bloody exciting. I'm used to having to trade out armor for that, but it's just a mod now, which is absolutely top tier. I'll take all the armor skill books. 
Uh, anything else I need in here? Not especially. AP 9mm. I'll take your gunpowder. I'll take your casings. You got a, you got a gyrocopter. Thanks for the offer, but I got one already. Uh, oil shale, general bank, lantern. Nothing really much. I'll take your cobble. And that'll probably do us. Yeah, it will. Do you have any wood, though? No, you don't. All right. Safe travels. You too, Knackers. Thank you so much. It's been somewhat of a pleasure. I mean, you gave me trippies, which always makes me happy. And actually, those books not only gave me iron quality five, but also gave me steel quality one. So I definitely can get a good upgrade going then. Speaking of upgrades, take you out, chuck you in. And how's my toesies looking? They're going to be cold, but they're going to be fast. Cold, but fast. The dream. Modify you. Got an extra spot. But I can't put either of those ones in because it's already chockers. Shit. Uh, I don't think I can put anything anywhere. I think I'm... I think I'm clapped. All right, fair play then. Let's jump back on the bike. In fact, do I start heading back home? That's the wrong bloody dorm. I probably do because it's getting rather late. I don't want to risk it. There's too much to live for now. Uh, <laughs> you're looking real angry at me. Look at the scare on him. He's mad. He knows that he knows that the other baker died. I'm sorry. I tried to save him. You don't need to do this. <laughs> you were looking at me. Very you were standing there menacingly. I had to do what I had to do. He he's that was like Terminator 2, like the liquid metal dude. Had his arms out, shoulders back, fucking waddling along like a pissed off penguin. Nah, I stand by that. I stand by that. I let his friend die and he knew about it. I tried to save him, didn't do enough, so I had to uh, I had to show him what I was actually capable of. That's a fucking top tier flying there though. Point north. Out of Tasmania we go. I like Tassie though. What a cool little place. I'll definitely come back here. I'm not going to go see Trady right now. I'm going to fly my gyro just gently up the road because it is a bit of a blizzard out here at the moment. I want to get some more crafting on the go. Jeez, I've got to, got to pull down rather steep, which I don't love. Although in the end, that's actually worked out pretty bloody well. Who are you? And what are you doing? Just standing around. Cop that one. Free XP. Thank you. Got to get those levels up. Oh, I left all the shit in the bloody car. Or the dryer, rather. Not really much of a car. You, come with me. Thank you. I've got all the cars now. Look at all the cars that I have. It's getting everything away where it needs to go. I've got a little bit of cement, but not much. Now that I know that I can make those bulk buckets of, of concrete, I'm definitely going to try and limit how much I waste this stuff. You, get your smelting away. I'm going to go like a cheeky one there and a cheeky one there. It's close enough to thirds. There needs to be a way that if I like pick you up and then hold right click and go bang, bang, bang across three, three squares or four squares or five squares or six squares, it'll split them evenly across those numbers because trying to split it into threes, I'm not smart enough to do that. It takes me way too bloody long. There was a game at some point that definitely lets you do that and I can't fully remember what it was. I'm just going to scrap you for the fabric because why not? What was that game? It was definitely, was it Ark? Might have been arc. I'm not sure, but it's definitely been a thing in the past, and I want it. I miss it for this. What I'm going to do, it's going to be sad to do it, but I should do it. I'm going to take my building blocks back. I'm going to take all of my building blocks back because they're just sitting out here being wasted anyway. Did someone just growl at me? Hello? Uh, <laughs> that whole pillar's gone. How are you standing? Oh, because you're attached there, still attached there, still. That's within an inch of its life. But yeah, I'm going to have to redesign, like, this whole place. This whole bloody joint. So taking all my building blocks back will save me some resources later. Um, you're a little fucked up, though, so the ones that I can't pick up, I will have... Ah! That's fine. That's fine. It was like that when I got here, almost literally. Losing another couple of cobblestone blocks is the least of my worries. Just going through and cleaning up all the rest of the wreckage. Couple of bits of wood in there, which is sad. There's no way to tell. I mean, there should be, right? Wooden wreckage should look different to, to stone wreckage, but... Ah, uh, well, <laughs> these are all just fever pipe dreams that I wish that I had. Get rid of all of you. I think the play overnight is going to be just to put as much stone as I can into that forge. Or as much as I can, but a reasonable amount. I'll take you back, thank you. Just to get as much concrete production going as I reasonably can. I keep hearing things. I keep hearing things and I know that that big boy spider rider can be out here somewhere, so I'm not thrilled about it. 
I don't really see much, hey. Don't really see much. Thing might be stitched up. There's like a whole sewer here as well. Right, I there's a bit this this shack in my in my car park this whole time that I've paid zero attention to. And it's a sewer. I'll probably clear that out actually. I need to get my armor sorted out first and foremost. Now I've got some points in the heavy armor. I really need to find that last urban combat book now so more than ever. Plus, obviously, either the last pistol paper book or the last um rifles book, uh sniper book. But now that I have the gyro. I can get around to the traders just that much easier. So I reckon, knowing that the traders open early, I might actually take off relatively early in the morning and go all the way up to Bob and go, Bob, Jen, skip over Melbourne, go and see Joel down there and then come back. Oh, actually, nah, because I want to go and explore more of Tassie. All right, we'll go bang, 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 hit all four traders on the way down, see what's going on down in Tasmania and what the good word is. I need to get some more of you on the craft though. You, do you have any more? Yep, get you cooking along. Nice, Gary. But I'll have to come back, try and buy those last books and go and explore some more of lovely Tazzy in the next episode because this episode is done. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the patrons of Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like, make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. I want to talk to you there first. I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.